Here's a trick to find the square root of any number under 10,000. So what you're going to do is you're going to write the number 0 to 9 at the top and then write below them what their squares are and highlight the final digit of each of their squares. Then say Dave asks you what the square root of 784 is. What you want to do is highlight the last number, the 4, and then you're going to look at your row of square numbers and find any that have final digit 4. So 64 and 4 both have last digit 4. These correspond to 8 and 2. So our final digit of our answer is either going to be 2 or 8. Then what you're going to do is you're going to cross off the last two digits, in this case the 84. So we're just left with a 7. Now we want to find the square number that is closest to 7 but is less than 7. So in this case 4 is the closest number to 7 that is smaller than 7. 4 corresponds to 2, so we're going to write down 2 here. So our answer is either 22 or 28, we just need to work out which one it is. To do this it's kind of random, we take this number that we've just found 2 and we multiply it by the number 1 above it, so 2 times 3 is 6. 7 is bigger than 6, so we take the bigger number. If 7 was smaller than this number, we would take the smaller number. So 7 is bigger than 6, so we take the 8. So the answer is 28. Indeed, if I check it on my calculator, 28 squared is indeed 784. So you can confidently tell Dave that the answer is 28. Let's try one more example. Say Dave gives you this instead. We're going to do the same method. We look at the last digit, in this case a 1. We look at the square numbers with final digit 1. So we've got 81 and 1. And these correspond to 9 and 1 respectively. So our final digit of our answer is either going to be 1 or 9. Then what we do is we cross off the final two digits of our big number here and we're left with 37. Now we look for the square number that is closest to 37 but is less than 37 and in this case it's 36 which is 1 below 37. 36 corresponds to 6 so we chuck down a 6 here then we do this random thing where we write down the number that we've just done so 6 and then we times it by 1 above 6, so we times it by 7. 6 times 7 is 42. 37 is less than 42, so we take the smaller number. So our answer is 61. Dave will be amazed.